While you were at Gainesboro, one of your office mates or someone down the hall from you was someone named Alfred Hitchcock. Oh, him. Oh, him. <laughs> yes. And I remember, too, once in, in, when he got to Hollywood, he'd made a picture called Strangers on a Train. Right. And everybody thought he was going to get the uh, Academy Oscar. Award yeah. for it. Yeah. And uh, I wrote him an Academy Award acceptance speech, which I sent him in Hollywood. The, the speech I gave him was uh, that he said, uh, I want to thank everybody for this award, uh, all the pe people of the motion picture industry, and, uh, of course, uh, I mustn't forget my accountant, my manager, my agent, and all my family, without whose help I'd have won this years ago. <laughs> and Hitch called me from Hollywood and said, I'm going to use it, I'm going to use it. So it's great, but he didn't win it that no. year. By the time he got psycho, he'd lost it, which is probably just as well. <laughs>
wicked chocolate craving. I just wanted good chocolate. I was so depressed. I was the depressed girl. And I knew of one really good chocolate shop down in the Third Street Promenade near where I lived. And I arrived in the line about the same time as another man who had gotten there and that sort of jockeying for position, like, oh no, you go ahead, you go ahead, and struck up a conversation with him. He gave me a card and told me that his name was David Milch and he had created a show called NYPD Blue and that he would read a script. And, you know, that was the amazing beginning.